Praise the name of the Lord. We thank God for another wonderful day. We can sing this song. This is the day that the Lord has made and we will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day. This is the day that the Lord has made. That the Lord has made. We will rejoice. We will rejoice and be glad in it. And be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made. A wonderful day that the Lord has made. And the power of Christ to Jesus, I hear that. 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 I that you are, you are not alone because he said he has caused innumerable of angels to be on your guide. Shall we go through the word of God? We go to the book of Colossians. So today and tomorrow, we will read uh, the book of Colossians chapter 2. I'm starting from verse 12. And the verse 12 says, Buried with him in baptism, in which we were also raised with him through faith, in the working of God, who raised him from the dead. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. This is a Bible scripture that I have put in the middle. But the reason why I quote this is that there are three important things in the life of a Christian when you, you, you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior. This helps you to overcome life challenges. This helps you to take away any negative things and notions that comes in our mind. This helps you to win a war, a spiritual warfare. This becomes the foundation of your, of your life as a Christian and also unto victory. Praise the name of the Lord. And pay, baby, I can't hear, baby, I bet you would ding. Now, more than you know, so no one who needs here, a chassis would ding, could you need near my, I shall show what dream we saw Christo near. A boo, a bem, never went to me, co anymore, what men are far who deem. Baby, I can't was it. Colossians chapter two, verse twelve, no, I say, buried with him in baptism. If I saw her, I near my way saying, Buried, buried with him in baptism. And we were also raised with him. Through faith in the working of God, who raised him from the dead. Child of God, listen to me. The reason why you are more than a conqueror, the reason why you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you, the reason why the enemy, irrespective of his power and his strength, cannot fight against you, the reason why you don't have for, uh, for somebody to intimidate you by just saying things against your life as a Christian is that. The moment you accepted Jesus Christ as your personal savior, we call it you are born again. What is meant by born again? Being born again is that uh, 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 through baptism, we were baptized. We were deep into the water. The moment you are deep into the water, it means you died. And when the water covers you, it means you are buried. Then when you are raised from the water, it means you have raised from the dead. So we have we died with Jesus Christ. We buried with Jesus Christ. And we are raised with Jesus Christ. So your old man, that is under curse. Your old man uh, that the enemy is able to overcome died with Jesus Christ, uh, buried with Jesus Christ, uh, but you have resurrected in a new life. That's why we call you, say you are born again. This gives you victory. That is why we always encourage you that you are more than a conqueror. I don't know if the Bible says, You are more than a conqueror. 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 And so I have body of a frodia, no kuni me dear wodia. We have body of a frodia. Ne fin we are born in no men, and you suit to me. We are body of a frodia. Ne or town for me page biara, a son say, A pam dada no and not or town for no edison kunimno. Yes, you Christo nam new wound, you sorry, and in so much superwamania far with you. We am a wood in a painting, and you tin a mecatcher or say, O young copo waffa, and in tin's room. And opinion, a person may catch it on say, We fear I catch it up on some say, Many pedia dano, and yes, you are boom. Shall we pray? Father, we thank you for what you did at the Calvary Cross for us. This gives us the foundation that we are more than conquerors. We move in your strength because we have become born again, a fresh person. 
a, a, a new man that the enemy cannot conquer because we have overcome the enemy in you, Christ Jesus. May this happen in our life as Christians and this morning as we move out in Jesus' name. Amen.